guys, it's me Roxy coming at you with a new video and today I'm going to be teaching you how to play Anthem by Greta Van Fleet on ukulele. If you guys haven't seen my cover of Anthem by Greta Van Fleet on ukulele, it will be at the end of the video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial and I hope you find it helpful. Make sure your ukulele is tuned to G, C, E, A and let's get started. The chords you're going to need for this entire song are A, B, F sharp, F sharp 7, E, and G. If you already know these chords or if you need to learn a certain chord, just skip to this time lapse. In order to play A, you're going to take your index finger and put it on the third string of the first fret. Then you're going to take your middle finger and put it on the fourth string of the second fret and it should sound like this. In order to play B, you're going to take your index finger and bar the first two strings of the second fret. Then you're going to take your middle finger and put it on the third string of the third fret. Then you're going to take your ring finger and put it on the fourth string of the fourth fret. And it should sound like this. In order to play F sharp, you're going to bar the first three strings with your index finger on the first fret. Then you're going to take your middle finger and put it on the second string of the second fret. Then you're going to take your ring finger and put it on the fourth string of the third fret. It should sound like this. In order to play F sharp 7, you're going to take your index finger and put it on the second string of the second fret. Then you're going to take your middle finger and put it on the fourth string of the third fret. Then you're going to take your ring finger and put it on the third string of the fourth fret. Then take your pinky and put it on the first string of the fourth fret. And together it should sound like this. In order to play E, you're going to take your index finger and put it on the first string of the second fret. Then you're going to take your pinky and put it on the second string of the fourth fret. Then put your ring finger right on top of that one, which would be the third string of the fourth fret. Then your middle finger will go right on top of that, which is the fourth string of the fourth fret. And together it should sound like this. In order to play G, you're going to take your middle finger and put it on the first string of the second fret. Then your ring finger is going to go on the second string of the third fret. Then you're going to place your index finger on the third string of the second fret. And it should sound like this. Now that you know how to play all of the chords, let's get started right on the intro and the verse. The chords you're going to need for the intro and the verse are B. F sharp and E. So starting off with the intro, our strumming pattern is quite simple yet complicated and this is why it will be on the screen. It is down down up 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 down up up down 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 up down down and I'll explain what I mean by that in a moment. We have our B and the B is gonna be down down up 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 down up up so it'll be like this. So practice that with me and go. Down, up, 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 down, up, up. Good job. Then we're gonna switch to that F sharp chord. So down, 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 up. So do it with me and go. So let's do the B and the F sharp together. Ready, go. Then we have two downs, which will be the E and the F sharp. So it'll sound like this. Just two down strums, super easy. So one down strum on the E, then one down strum on the F sharp. So let's practice that. Awesome. So let's put it all together starting from the beginning. Ready? Go. Down, down. repeats to the B. You have learned the entire intro 
and the verse. So let's do the intro and the verse together and I'll sing while you play. So let's do it starting from the very beginning. Ready? Go! Awesome, good job! Congratulations, you just learned the intro and the verse of the song. So now, we're moving on to the pre-chorus, which is the Your Opinion Only Knows part. So, let's get into it. The chords you're going to need for the pre-chorus are B, F sharp, E, and F sharp 7. We are going to have kind of the same strumming pattern. It's going to change a little bit. So the strumming pattern is going to be down, down, up, 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 down, up. But the second time around, it's going to be down, 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 up, down, up, down, down. So I'll explain what I mean by that and demonstrate. For the B, we're going to have down, down, just straight up. And then we're going to switch to that F sharp, and it's going to be up, 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 down, up. So it'll sound like this together. So let's do that together. Ready, go. Perfect. Then we're going to move on to the E, and it's going to be the full down, down, up, 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 down, up. So it'll sound like this. So do that with me. Ready, go. So let's put the whole thing together, well, almost the whole thing, which is going to be the B, the F sharp, and the E. Ready, go! Nice! So now we're going to move on to the second part of the pre-chorus, which it kind of changes a little. Once you hit the B the second time, it's going to be down, 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 up. And then when we switch to that F sharp, it's going to change to down, up, down, down. So I'll demonstrate how it'll sound. Do it with me. Down, 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 up, down, up, down, down. One more time. Down, 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 up, down, up, down, down. Good job! And then when we hit the E the second time, it's going to be the same strumming pattern. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. So let's do it together since you already know it. Good job. So let's put it all together so far up to the second time we hit E. Ready, go. Good job. Now we're moving on to the part where it's like to save yourself in your own time. That part. So after we hit that E, We're going to go to, to save yourself in your own time. So the B is going to be the same thing as the first one. And the F sharp is going to be the same. The E is going to be the same strumming as the very first time. The only thing that's going to change is once we hit the last F sharp, it's just going to be one down strum. And then we're going to go into the F sharp 7. And that's where you hit it. So it'll sound like this, all together, the whole pre-chorus. Your opinion only knows the one thing that you seem to have most. And you chose to save yourself in your own time. You'll have to stay and open up your own mind. Now do it with me. Ready, go. Your opinion only knows the one thing that you see to want to have most. And you chose to save yourself in your own time. You'll have to stay, you know, then up your own. Down strum, F 
sharp seven. <gasps> Congratulations, you learned the pre-chorus. Now we're moving on into the chorus. So the chords you're gonna need for the chorus are B, F sharp, and E. The strumming pattern is almost exactly identical to the verse in the intro. Let me just demonstrate, so. So that B and the F sharp are just going to be pretty much down strums. And every so the only time you'll have like an up is when you're in between the switching chords. So you see that? Awesome. Then we're going to have that down, up, down, down again, but the third time round. So it'll be like this. And every glow in the twilight knows. The second time, the world is on. What the world is made of. Third time, just you and me can agree to disagree. And it's not going to be at the fourth time. Of. And then you're gonna just do one downstrum on the B. Uh oh. Alright, simple enough. If you could do the verse and the pre chorus, you could do this with no problem. So let's do it together. And go! And every glow in the twilight knows that the world is only what the world is made of. So, third time coming up right now. You just learned the chorus. Now on to verse 2. Oh wait, it's the same exact thing as verse 1. So let's move on to the next chorus. The chords you're going to need for the chorus are B, F sharp, E, G, and A. The next chorus is exactly the same thing except Instead of the B, uh oh, we're gonna move to a G. The strumming pattern is really simple. It's just down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down. So do that with me. G, A, B, ready, go. Perfect. So let's do the entire second chorus from the beginning of the chorus. Ready, and. Course, you're gonna do that strumming pattern like down, up, down, down, and then you're gonna repeat that strumming pattern. So you're gonna keep doing that, that down, up, down, down until you get into the chorus. And honestly, it's completely up to you how long you want to keep going. I also forgot the yeah, 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 but that's just the same strumming pattern, yeah, yeah. forth so it is optional to end in a chorus like where you just stop just you and me can agree to disagree or you can just do single down strums just you and me only what the world is made of and then you're gonna end on a B because that's the key right? congratulations 
congratulations! You learned the entire song of Anthem by Greta Van Fleet. I am so proud of you. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. I work really, really hard on these tutorials. So, please give it a thumbs up to show that it helped you in any way, shape, or form. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing down below. And also, don't forget to tap the notification bell. I love you guys so much, and Jesus loves you more than I ever could. And don't ever forget it. Drink your smoothie, and don't forget to stay groovy. Bye, you guys.